facial recognition is not something new. We have been seeing facial recognition technologies for quite quite some time. I mean, Apple iPhone or even Samsung has ported the facial recognition onto the phone recently. But the thing is, historically, facial recognition is not something new. I think one of the reasons why um, the, the security folks are concerned about privacy is because when we are using facial recognition, basically the, the technology is transferring our facial, the way how we look into unique data. Now, how are we going to protect that unique data is, is the primary concern, I believe. What are the chances that this feature could be used for malicious purposes? How could criminals abuse this technology? The thing is this, whenever you scan your face over to the facial recognition device, the facial data will be used to compare against what has been stored to grant you the access or give you the, the permission to do something. Now, that kind of unique data, if it's obtained by the criminals, then people can impersonate you by just using those data. Could the facial recognition feature be hacked or tricked in any way? And what security implications could it have? Of course, uh, nothing is foolproof. But then again, looking at the, the trend of technologies, I mean, if you look at a history, facial recognition, uh, there's so many ways to bypass or even hack facial recognition technologies. People will be using photographs of uh, the real person. People can uh, do a makeup. and But the thing is this, because of the, the advancement of technologies, now we have things like machine learning. Biometric devices like facial recognitions are getting more and more advanced and it is not, it's not that easy for casual criminals to bypass facial recognition anymore. So from a security perspective, I'm actually hoping to see that even the phone manufacturers, they're actually going to put on more uh, research into, into machine learning and uh, make the facial recognition technology more, uh, more mature. How secure is this technology in your opinion? And what's the likelihood that, for instance, a database of phone users' faces could be leaked or stolen? I think if you're referring to the iPhone or, or Samsung phone uh, facial recognition, I think one of the biggest concerns is is that is the facial data, is it going to be shared with the phone manufacturer or is it going to be stored locally on the phone? Now, if it's going to be stored locally on the phone and what kind of protection the manufacturer is applying in place to protect those sensitive data. Now, if those data are sent back to the manufacturer themselves, we have a much greater concerns because we will need to know, I mean, the users, the consumers will have a more concern because those data, if it's end up at the manufacturer's end, I mean, there's way too many possibilities that manufacturer can use those data for. Is it possible that this technology can be used in any other kind of applications like um, front doors or home security? Oh, definitely, yes. Even in China, if you look at China, uh, a lot of restaurants are currently already using facial recognition to identify their customers. They are, they are uh, you know, warm customers. There are even restaurants who use facial recognition to uh, predict, you know, the emotion of the customers. And uh, from there, they, they would customize the menu for them. So facial recognition is, is a very good technology. Now, the thing is, privacy is one thing. It is a ma major concern, actually. And lastly, on a positive note, could this technology be used in any way to help investigations or, for instance, fights against terrorism? Definitely. If you ever go to China or uh, UK, most likely you have already been profiled by the police. So uh, the law enforcement can definitely can make use of facial recognition to quickly identify potential criminals, potential uh, questionable individuals. So yeah, definitely this is a good technology. It's just that um, the way how we're going to secure the, uh, the facial data is more critical.